Top six animals that kill the most people every year. Number five, hippos. Depending on the content you consumed, you think hippos are either the cutest thing ever or the scariest thing ever. And the scariest thing ever is the correct answer. So don't let videos like this fool you. Hippos weigh two to three tons, are capable of running over 20 miles per hour, and are equipped with foot-long tusk. According to Animal A to Z, Hippos are responsible for over 500 deaths every year. For reference, here are some news articles. Number 4. Crocodiles Crocodiles don't need an introduction as to why they are scary. According to sources, crocodiles kill 1,000 people worldwide every year. Crocs are ancient, having been around for over 80 million years. They still use the same hunting method as their ancestors. Wait at the water's edge for an unsuspecting victim, ambush them, drown them, or immediately proceed to rip toddler-sized chunks of flesh off their prey's body like a true psychopath. For the most part, attacks occur in Africa and Southeast Asia. Number 3. Dogs When you think dogs, you probably think of an obedient Labrador Retriever or a cute poodle, but never about a rabid beast running amok. According to sources, approximately 59,000 people die every year from rabies and the main culprit, you guessed it, rabid dogs. So how does this happen? Approximately 4.5 million people in the US are bitten by dogs every year, 800,000 of those seek medical care. 30,000 reconstructive procedures and 10 to 20 individuals who die. Other developed countries like Australia, Canada, France, and etc. have more or less the same numbers. So where are the 59,000 annual deaths coming from? You see, in the Western world, rabies are a problem of the past as we have rabies shots not just for us but for our dogs as well. And in underdeveloped countries, medical infrastructure is almost non-existent. And without medical care, rabies can prove to be very deadly. Number 2. Snakes According to sources, over 5 million people are bit every year by snakes. And out of those bites, 2.4 million people suffer envenomation, 400,000 amputations, and anywhere from 125,000 to 94,000 people are killed. So how does a snake kill somebody? Venom, of course. Snake venom is a mixture of proteins, that are used to immobilize prey, as snake venom can cause internal bleeding and blood clots. These toxins injure slash kill cells and trigger inflammation. But keep in mind that there is four different types of venom. Snakes that do contain these abilities usually inject two different types of venom. And like rabies, this affects the entire world, but more developed countries suffer less fatalities due to medical advancements. A piece by the BBC seems to back this idea further, reporting over 1 million deaths exclusively from snake bites in India over the past 20 years. And last but not least, we have not one animal, but a group of parasitic harboring bugs like mosquitoes and freshwater snails. Mosquitoes are found everywhere on this planet, excluding Antarctica of course, and have been around since the Jurassic period. But as mentioned before, they harbor parasites within them that prove to be deadly to people. For example, malaria, responsible for over 400,000 deaths a year, dengue, infecting 200 million people and killing another 22,000 people every year, and Japanese encephalitis, a viral brain infection that kills over 10,000 people every year. Next, freshwater snails. Freshwater snails carry a parasite which infects 250 million people yearly and kills another 200,000. That is all for today. If you liked that video, please consider subscribing. Until next time.